This morning, the city of Boulder has made changes to an intersection that they say has seen the highest number of crashes and even severe crashes. Nine News reporter Brianna Fernandez is live along 28th and Colorado Avenue. Brianna, what kind of improvements have they made out at that intersection? Yeah, the improvements that a lot of people will see at 28th and Colorado Avenue include a multi-use path, traffic signals, and then also spaces between cars and bikes. That way it could, they could better see both the vehicle and the bicyclist that's coming through this intersection. Not only that, but the city of Boulder tells me that they also made some changes when it comes to the bus lane. So take a look at your screen. This is actually some of the changes that you'll see here. So for those who travel here often, there were also changes uh, to those bus lanes. So they will now be marked in red, similar to the green markings that we see for bikes. City officials here in Boulder say this is a heavily traveled area. So this intersection, if you're not familiar with it, it's just off Highway 36, close to the CU Boulder's main ca uh, campus. So you have to think about everyone that passes through here. You have students who walk through this uh, area to get to class, folks riding their bikes, scooters, plus tons of cars and CU's bus transit. So here's a breakdown of what the city of Boulder has seen throughout the years. There have been a total of 134 crashes since 2018. 21 of those crashes happened in 2021 including two that involved cyclists. A year later, the city reported 14 crashes, and then last year there were 19, two that involved pedestrians. We've, we've seen improvements, and we've also heard from the community that they have appreciated the improvements. They feel safer, and especially with CU Boulder coming back to school this fall, we expect to see more improvements in people's experience on the intersection. Yeah, so the city of Boulder is actually looking to make improvements at other intersections. That includes uh, includes Baseline, Iris, as well as Folsom Street. And if you'd like to learn more about those projects and all the changes that they plan to make here in the city of Boulder, you can head over to 9news.com. For now, I'm live here in Boulder. Brianna Fernandez for 9 News. All in the name of safety for Absolutely. drivers and the students there. Brianna, thank you.